Salutations, everybody. It is Maddie here today. One. That's how many hours of sleep I'm currently running on right now. We're at the airport. I'm heading to an event for Fallout 76, and I'm really stoked. But first, let's go over my morning. So all this cost seventeen dollars. I got my boy Juice Head here. Right. I got you a gift, man. Did you? I oh, planned this out ahead of time. <laughs> That's funny. That's perfect. Not sponsored Thank by you. Tropicana. Yeah, no, unfortunately. <laughs> Home stretch, so close to a bed right now. I can't fucking wait. We're just on fumes right now, bro. <laughs> what do you have to say about Fallout 76? Are you gonna release this before or after the embargo? This is That's after the embargo. <laughs> uh, it's really, I don't know, we got three hours to play it and I feel like we just got enough time to really get into it and we didn't, I don't know. I needed like 20 hours of like, all right, I get it. It's 20 hours? Soon. I would have done it, dude. We were there for two days. I would have I played it 48 hours straight. <laughs> I know right. you guys will see, you'll see. Alright, alright. Uh, go melee. If you want to level up quick, kill everything. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we were with the UFC middleweight champion. And he was like, I'm just going to punch everything to death. And he ended up like double our level. <laughs> we were like doing quests and shit and he was just punching everything. And he, he power leveled, dude. Okay. I feel really important right now. We're about to board a private plane to go play Fallout. I really think this is the, the, the top peak of my career. So, here we go, about to land on Greenbrier. So we're on a bus now, and I honestly feel like I'm back in elementary school, we're on like a little field trip right now, you know? We're, we've been traveling all day, and we're gonna go to a really cool historical place. We're gonna do some fun shit and then we're gonna leave. So we're gonna play a game called Spot the Fallout 76 Location. A little new car game for when we're traveling together. Right now we're passing a golf course. Actually, they can't see it now. Fuck. Yeah, yeah, that's Bad trees. footage. <laughs> Alright, you think this is the location right here? Thank you, Yeah. Yeah. Very yeah. thing. <laughs> Sounds like a nice spot for some ghouls. <laughs> inside a location of Fallout 76. This is exciting. Okay, after a day of flying, shuttling everywhere, I am happily in my room, and you guys have to see this place. It is insane. So, we walk in through the door over here, and you make a right, bathroom's here, and you can already get an old school feel, right? Floral, wallpaper. Uh, right here we got the mirror. That's a great looking man right there. Anyway, it's just the extra things that this hotel does. Like, I can stick my hand in here. There is a compartment for my extra soaps, my toilet paper in case things really get rowdy in here. And then of course, we have the soap. Look at this soap, man. It's great. This is some high class stuff. Great looking toilet there. But <laughs> across the hallway, we have the closet, which is walk-in nonetheless. I mean, it's just like an apartment, man. That's just crazy about this. We got the safe down here. Nothing special. Comes with an umbrella. I've never actually seen that before. But anyway, this is what you guys will care about the most. Wow. This is colonial, I feel. I mean, look at the art on the wall, the wallpaper, how tall the room is in general. Like I said, man, this is ridiculous. Big ass TV. We got some snacks here. I've never seen alcohol mixed with Twix, M&Ms, and Snickers, but um, that's a first. Big bed all to myself, and then let's see the view. I'm curious about that, and uh, okay, well, uh, <laughs> that's probably the most underwhelming part of it all. I get a nice view of the rooftop. Oh my gosh, and over here we even have a separate desk that I can sit here and edit at. This is ridiculous. Holy crap. I mean, talk about 
a lot of money put into this place. Right now, I'm currently running on one hour of sleep, so I'm ready to crash right now. I'm gonna take a nap. They've given us some free time for a couple hours until uh, we go out and do some activities that are gonna be really exciting. So I'm gonna pass out right now, and I'll catch you in a sec. All right, we're heading to meet up with everybody right now. My sleep schedule is so shot right now, but it's gonna be a really fun evening, so let's get it started. I need to shake your hand. Excellent. Excellent. There we go. <laughs> Great content. Let's go. Bucket list right there, baby. My fellow Americans. <laughs> <laughs> they wanted me to do a thing like turning around in the chair, but I thought without a Persian cat, it just wouldn't have the right effect. So apparently it's Reclamation Day, in case you didn't know. He's actually real. And these are, hold on, they feel a little squishy. Oh. No, no, I think they're real. No, they're real? Real. They're all going to be squishy. That's what I mean. Yeah, they're for. First donut. Yeah, there we go. First of the night. It's a good donut. It's an, oh, it's a very good donut. <laughs> Vault Boy suit is empty. <laughs> Someone in this room is the Vault Boy. And that's actually Nobody kind of proven me. until we find out who murdered the Vault Boy. That's what I'm saying, bro. He's alive and moving. Not sure what happened. Well, that was certainly fun. <laughs> I had a chance to meet a lot of YouTubers, streamers, members of Bethesda I had yet to be introduced to. Now, we're gonna change outfits into dress clothes and head down to the casino. The Greenbrier has a dress code rule for the casino. If you are not wearing dress clothes and a sports jacket, you cannot get in. So I have to rent a sports jacket from here, but we're gonna see what this place is all about. Also, I wanna include a message in this vlog because I know it's been pretty freaking amazing, but a lot of YouTubers, when they vlog, they highlight all of the amazing stuff going on, but they never talk about the real shit, and so a lot of viewers feel like every YouTuber's life is perfect or the perception of perfect, and I know I try to vlog and talk about the real issues too, like when I shared my story about anxiety and depression, but I just know that while this is absolutely incredible, it's not a representation of my daily life. I just thought this would be a really fun idea for you guys to see the Greenbrier, a major part of Fallout 76, and um, pretty much what I'm doing out here. But anyway, let's head to the casino. It's gonna be weird, because I don't like gambling. I'm not into that type of stuff, but um, we're just gonna see what people are up to there. And the final product, not too bad. I like it. Gray pants are my favorite though, personally. All right, let's go. And the outfit is never complete without the on-brand watch. Little things it's like crazy. This. Rad poker. I just wish there was like something in here. It's just an empty box. It's such a cool looking box. <laughs> Build a crazy contraption piece by piece as you race around the track. It's, it's too short. It's not for thick armed people. <laughs> well, this is beyond my intelligence. I th oh, look, there's a gap in there. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to figure out. Three YouTubers try to figure out a pit boy. <laughs> he catches onto traction there and then you just 
Oh, oh, there we go. No, no, oh, no. no. I thought you had something. That looks that was so deceptive. Good too. Yeah, like you had the snap and everything. I was like, that's got to be it. <laughs> so there's the tray for the hollow tape, but how do you pop it out? Yeah, imagine this is like the intro of Fallout 76. The guy like puts on the pit he's like, what the hell is this thing? Can you not pop it out? Hey, there's a button. Isn't there a hot... Yeah, Let's hand it over to the third YouTuber. Yeah. <laughs> These buttons, like, are all real, though. Oh, wow. It's so comfy, it's... though. I, I wish I had a pillow made out of oh. the inside of the... Oh, you got it! <laughs> you succeeded, we're all over yeah. failed. Alright, so Juice has smartest of all of us. <laughs> Evidently. <laughs> there are light helps. Wow. <laughs> Fancy. Oh, I guess I'm, if you had it on like this, I guess that... Yeah. Alright. I like how the light <laughs> turned off now. It's like the light yeah. shine just to highlight that we made a discovery. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh my goodness. Oh. Wow. So are they giving us one of these away to us? <laughs> so this is coming in the press kit, right? <laughs> Love this scene here. This is kind of just like the living room from Fallout 4. And then in a second, I'm a, yeah, we'll, we'll be where we are right now. So this is the main lobby. Over there's reception where you oh, checked in. Yeah, this is terrifying. <laughs> yeah, oh my security. god. That's where, that's where we had to go check in to get people coats so they could go to the casino. <laughs> there. Now we're upstairs. Yeah, but down, down this hallway. Yeah, this all looks familiar. Do you recognize this, this carpet? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> so, Governor's Hall, that's where we are right now. So that's the door you came in this morning. If you went in there, that would be where we ate breakfast this morning. The next door over, that's actually where we are playing the game right now. Yeah, we actually can't go in there. Remember, remember the party we went to last night, the Reclamation Day party? If you follow me upstairs, we can't go in because it's locked. But there's that false wall. Oh, it's the got the little hand scanner on it. And there's the bank of elevators at some yeah, of you may have taken to my room. your room.